Hey, this is Presh Talwalker. In this video, I'm going to teach you a trick which fools many people. Start by taking a rectangular strip of paper and drawing 13 straight black lines. You can follow along with me if you have a rectangular strip of paper. Now very carefully, cut the shape diagonally across this line. It goes from the top of the first line to the bottom of the last line. Once you make the cut, you'll have two pieces of paper. Now slide the upper piece along the diagonal up and to the left so that it exactly lines up. You now have a new shape which has only 12 lines. The original shape had 13 lines, so clearly you have shown that 13 lines equal 12 lines, so 13 is equal to 12. All we did was rearrange the same lines. The question is, how did one line just vanish? Where did the missing line go? Now, when you show this, many people know that something is amiss, but very few people can explain exactly what's going on. Can you figure it out? Give this problem a try, and when you're ready, keep watching the video for the solution. So I'm telling you the new shape has 12 lines, and the original shape had one extra line with 13 lines, and it appears that all of the lines are of the same length. But that, in fact, is the issue. The missing line is an illusion. The new shape has 12 lines, but they are longer lines. Each line is longer by 1 12th compared to the original shape. In other words, the missing line length is distributed evenly into each of the new lines. The reason you can't see this is because the 12 lines and the 13 lines look like they're the same length. But if you measure carefully, you'll actually see that these 12 lines are longer. So we'll focus on just one of these lines. Now let's compare it in length to the original shape you can see that it's just a little bit longer. It's 1 12th longer compared to the original line. So this illusion works because you have so many lines and you're only changing the length by very little. If you were to do this with only four lines, you'd actually be able to see that the lines are longer. But that's the reason this illusion works. Did you figure it out? Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel. I make videos on math. You can catch me on my blog, Mind Your Decisions, which you can follow on Facebook, Google Plus, and Patreon. You can catch me on social media at Presh Talwalker. And if you like this video, please check out my books. There are links in the video description.